The fight to save Graceland is on. And look, there's a lot of conflicting stories about, you know, uh, the way that this went down. This is Elvis Presley's home, which is actually a significant tourist destination. But due to the fact, right, that um, the Elvis's wife, you know, apparently had, you know, secured a loan, you know what I mean, on another property that she failed to pay, just goes to say, look, it doesn't matter what the excuse is. If you pay, you stay. If you don't, you go, right? So unfortunately, she passed away. This all kind of fell to the daughter. And now the daughter is in disarray, right? That she might actually lose Graceland, Elvis's home place, right? It'd be a huge tragedy. Obviously, the private sector is clamoring to try to buy an asset like that that they can, you know, monetize over the long term as a tourist attraction, you know, or many other uses, right? But this just goes further to substantiate that, you know, whether or not it's a loan on that particular property or it's a financial obligation to something else, it now gives the creditors and debtors something to pursue as an asset. So if you pay, you stay. If you don't, you go. And this could prove to be a very tough lesson for Elvis's family.